Hi Taurus, I hope you're okay. I'm Clarissa. I'm here for your Love Tower reading. So let's see what's in store for Taurus. And Taurus, if you like the messages, please like and follow. Thank you. All right, Taurus, how do they feel about you? Six of Wands, they want to have, you know, a really high energy love here. They want to be recognized in this love. They want you to recognize the energy that they put in to you and for you it's almost like there is a, a knowing that they can have a really good time it's like, i think they're they're feeling farther ahead they're thinking that they that you could be the one to renew their energy give them back their spice you know something that can really um yeah it's something that's just really kind of appreciated you both appreciate each other or you're both yeah desires coming up there's a there's a strong element of desire here and i think that has been it's like this is what's standing strong there's been some kind of victory here or victory over the emotions what is their true intentions ace of cups yeah this could be a, a beginning of a, or a, a newer layer to the love you know so this ace of cups is saying that you, you've always had this knowing about the love almost in the palm of your hand <laughs> It's almost like a, you've been holding on to this concept of love and it's starting to appear for you, Taurus. It's like love is starting to appear in the way that you want it to. So it's almost like you're, uh, they've got this knowing about what you want. And so maybe they're wanting to, you know, show you. I feel like there's a, an openness here. There's a, there's a need to show you or maybe a need for you to show everything. Almost like... um. This is who I am. This is who I present myself. This is my true version of myself. And you, you've kind of taken the risk because, you know, once you do that, the passion is ignited or their passion is ignited for you. What brings you together? Queen of Swords. I think like there's an, uh, this is a, an air sign card. So this is Libra, Aquarius and Gemini. But there is a, a slight detachment here with the emotion. And maybe that's what's doing good or maybe that's... Uh, helping you to feel a bit more like I want a bit more there is a uh, maybe the communication is almost like direct but then sometimes it's like it, it's withdrawn as well so sometimes you feel like maybe it's not there so maybe this is creating this intrigue and this is what's increasing the passion as well because it's it's uh where is my attention <laughs> I want attention and so when you do speak it feels really good because you go into this emotional intelligence and maybe you're wanting more or they're wanting more from you in, in terms of that so what pulls your part ha, knight of wands there is this um maybe you're feeling like this person is not fully committed just yet or you've got a feeling like there is a you know multiple energies because you you see their level of desire you see their level of passion and you feel like is it just directed just at me or is it something that this person you know does so with this Knight of Wands, Angies, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, this is someone who is about their passion, it does drive forward. They're still in the element of um, they know their own attractive energies, they know what they want, they they go for what they want, you know, they kind of think later about things. And But there is an element of growth, there is room for growth here. So what is in the hidden? Justice card major kind of for Leo, Libra. Kind of Libra energy did come up in the beginning in my mind. So I feel like you, you could be dealing with some uh, need to balance of the energies because it was like this, the six of one. So it's you know, balance. So um, with the justice card, there is this need to, it's almost like maybe you feel like you're, sh you're only giving what you're being, what you're being shown or you're only, uh, you can only give as much as you are getting. You don't want to, you don't want to put in more than, what you're giving is like a sense of value here so you want there to be a mirroring you want there to be a sense of balance so maybe you're trying to uh, see what the balance is determine what the balance is the justice card also could be you know having to deal with paperwork and things like that and um, making sure that your value is seen in in a procedure or maybe a legal process but in terms of love relationship there is a need to create this balance there is a need for energetic reflection so what is success? Four of Pentacles. Yeah, you're making sure you have some of your emotions in your reserve. <laughs> you're not giving too much, but it's like at some point you you understand that they want 
they want to see a lot from you. They want to see who you are. They want to see the transparency. They want to feel your vulnerability. But you have an air of caution here. You like, okay, I can give you communication. We can talk. We can, you know, engage in the emotional stimulation in, in terms of our thought process. But what is it that you're going to show me? What is it? I think like you're wanting them to prove themselves or something. So you're just, uh, you're making sure that you don't it's like give away too much in terms of your emotional security. And I think that's probably wise, retaining some things back for yourself, especially because it's how you feel in terms of money as well, ensuring that you're saving in some things because with, the, with an, a high energy, passionate type of um, individual, there is going to be, you know, this element of let's do this, let's do that. And those things cost money. <laughs> All right. But it's good for you. Let's get an, uh, a card that just confirms everything. Yeah, two of pentacles. Again, we're, we're going back to this, you know, a notion of balance. There was a need to ensure that uh, you are able to have the emotional balance as well as the security of that balance. So what does that feel like for you? Do you Are you feeling like you're having to put more in from yourself or are they giving too much or too little? It's really ensuring that you know what the balance is and how to feel secure. Are they making you feel secure as you want to? Do you need to be queen of swords and speak? All right, Taurus, thank you so much for being here. I'll see you later. Bye.